Oh, come on, Bill, sit up. That's a chair, not a bed. That's better. Watch it now, here she comes. Well, hello, Bill, how are you? Fine, thanks. I didn't expect to see you in costume. <laughs> That's pretty clever. Well, thank you. You did pretty well yourself. Well, thanks. Do you like it? I certainly do. There's Ellen, I want to see her. Have fun. Well, now, wasn't that better? Look at the effect of a little politeness. You've had a very pleasant talk with Martha's mother. Well, she seemed friendlier than usual. That's because you were friendly and courteous. Now, look over to your left. Martha's introducing a stranger to the group. She'll be here soon. Suppose you had to make the introductions. How would you do it? Me? Oh, well, I'm not going to. That's Martha's job. Well, we can fix that up pretty easily. All it takes is a little switch. And now you have to do the introducing. Martha, Hank. Hold it, Bill. Not so good. Let's go back to the beginning and let Martha show you how. Bill, I'd like to meet Hank Martin. This is Bill Brent. Hi. I'm glad to know you. Hank is the fellow who won the city math contest last week. Except for that, he's normal. Well, say, you could help me with my algebra, couldn't you? Well, I could try. Well, not now. This is a party, remember? Besides, I want to meet my mother. Oh. Goodbye, Bill. See you later, Bill. You're sure thing, Hank. You see, a good introduction makes meeting people simpler and more pleasant. Sure, you're right. But there's so much to learn how to do. Sure, there's a lot to learn. But it's worth it. And learning is easy. One way is by watching others. Oh, oh here comes Cal. About time, too. How long does it take to take your coat off? Easy, Bill. Is it going to help any of you complain? No. All right. Be friendly, thoughtful. Join in the fun. You'll get along. I'll see you at refreshment time. Huh? Hi, Bill. Oh, hi, Carol. Oh, come on, let's join the gang. Sure. Some refreshments, aren't you hungry? Good idea. You could get some for Carol, too. That is a good idea. Are you talking to yourself? Oh, no, I was just thinking. I'll get you some food. Why, thank you, Bill. Oh, oh. oh dear. Oh, I'm sorry, Joan. Oh, it was all my fault. I didn't watch where I was going. <laughs> you didn't watch where you were going. Here, I'll get you some more. Oh, you don't have to, Bill. It's all right. Here. You want some no. apple? Okay. Thank you. It's all right. Now you're getting the idea, Bill. Be friendly. Be thoughtful. What do you think of social courtesy now? I guess it makes being with people a lot more enjoyable for me. And more enjoyable for them, too. You've made a good impression on people here. Listen. Isn't that the boy who used to be so rude? Why, River. You hear that? She says you're not as rude as you used to be. What do you know? And look at Carol. You don't change yourself. Why, he's actually nice now. I'm glad I came with him. Really? Well, those few changes made a big difference, didn't they? Yes, social courtesy does make a difference. And it's easy to learn. You can learn by watching others. 
And you can even get a book on courtesy from the library. I might have said. Sorry I took so long. I had an accident. Thank you. Bill, I'm having some of the kids over to my house next Saturday night. I'd like to have you come, too. Oh, I don't... Sure. Sure, I'd like to come. Sure. Thanks for asking me. Social courtesy does pay, doesn't it? Thanks.